than that, we don't even know how many were reported. Were actually, I want to say that they that their clothing was ripped off of them. They were pretty much left just with their underclothes to show a sign of, uh, how do I say, punishment. To somehow set an example to say, if you go into LA dressed like that, that there's going to be consequences. And that was being led by the establishment. And we see they couldn't stop us. Look, we're still here. We're still dressing like this. And look how beautiful it is. The community is out, and we're making history, and we're going to keep it going. And that's what it's all about. Like you said, you got to study your, your history, don't let it repeat itself, and we're just going to move forward, keep the style going, keep the culture alive. And, and I'm glad to uh, be with Legends. I uh, had a lot of good stuff. Hopefully, one day I can be like you guys. I, I, I get involved with the community too. I'm active. I'm ready to fight. The fight continues, and it starts with everybody. And I want to say that we all that we also passed a, an important motion. A motion is like a bill at the County Board of Supervisors this past two weeks. And that's the first time that we have the entire board understand the importance and significance of what the Zoot Suit uh, culture is about, what 